this is a fight you can we're like a month and a half out Ryan but you see two months out you hear the fans talking about it people are so jazzed so psyched for this fight uh a little bit away how are you feeling though has uh, training camp going as you prepare to fight Devin Haney uh I mean it's been going great uh I feel in phenomenal shape it's the best I've been um, up until this point every 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 time I go to a new camp it's always going to be the best one because you just keep getting better um and I, I'm prepared and I'm ready to go it, it seems like you're you've been really fired up uh things have obviously gotten heated at times Ryan is this more personal than some of the other fights or is this just business as usual for you to me um it is personal in a way I, Learn this. I don't know. Something is just in me, and just I don't even feel like answering these questions, bro. I'm sorry, bro. But can we do the next one? I'm sorry. Can we do the next. Yeah, one? you don't. You want to answer that question specifically? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go to the next question. I'm sorry. Sure, of course. No, hey, you're you're all good, bro. Um, you 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 are an underdog. You listen to the uh, the experts. Do you put any credence? Do you care about any of that stuff, Ryan? No, because where I came from, I was already the underdog, so I already defiled those odds, so it's not. It's just a term people use. Do you think, obviously, and I know you have a, a lot of respect for Devin's boxing ability, but do you believe that he is the toughest opponent you've ever faced, obviously knowing you've been in there with some of the most dangerous men in the entire world? Yeah, I don't think he's, I mean, you said I respect his boxing. Or if you don't, tell me if I'm. Hey, if you don't, I don't, tell give, me I don't give a fuck about his boxing skills. I'm gonna beat his ass, and that's it. Is Devin Haney an <laughs> overrated fighter? People, people will tell you he's the best guy out of you know you, Devin, uh, are you uh, Tank Shakur, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. People will say he's the best. He's the most talented. Is that nonsense? I'm not a boxing analyst. I'm not gonna tell anybody. So forget that dude. He's gonna get it. 420. That's it. Smoking all that Bill Haney pack for sure. Are you content to go in there and win, or do you really want to hurt this guy and, and put him away, meaning this fight ends in a knockout? I'm just like, God's will be done, not mine. That's all I'm saying. I'm coming in there with vengeance. And, uh, you said you want the fight to be in Las Vegas. It's right now not scheduled. Not anymore, not anymore. No, no, no. New York. I love New York. Shout out New love York. Love New York. <laughs> Shout out New York. We're cutting out the narrative anymore. It's done. Okay, so fight's, go here. fights going down in Brooklyn. Awesome to hear as a New York guy. Uh, anything you'd say to Devin Haney right now before I let you go, right? I don't even got the energy anymore. <laughs> Just, you know, he knows what's going to happen. 420. <laughs>